The new Frontier Hotel and Casino, where Elvis Presley made his Las Vegas debut in 1956, was imploded on Monday to make way for a multi-million dollar hotel, the Plaza Las Vegas, to be built by Israeli tycoons Nochi Duncan and its Chuva. The new luxury resort will hold over 3,500 rooms, private residences, retail space, and a casino, and will resemble the Plaza Hotel in New York, also owned by Chuva. At a cocktail party to celebrate the project, the two millionaires said they hoped the Plaza will be a source of pride for all. Let me promise all of you today that we will build this beautiful city one of the most magnificent hotels in the world. With many garden attractions. I have faith in the American economy and in the leaders of this city. We commit here to the further economic development of Las Vegas, along with advancing the principles of social responsibility and support to the community. I have the confidence that the Las Vegas Plaza will be a new and impressive icon which will turn into a source of pride for all of us. Not only Elvis Presley, but many other famous performers played at the Frontier Hotel, which was the second resort built on the Strip. The last performance was Diana Ross and the Supremes in 1970. In Las Vegas, the past makes way for the future.